Hello friends and welcome. Welcome to a double unboxing. Today I uh, received at the post office two packages and I will start with the small one. It uh, should contain an interesting item from Pelican and of course my trusted little Pelican Schollingen made in Germany. Little knife and I will try to open as gentle as I can this box. So I will start with this part. Okay. And I must tell you guys that I'm uh, excited about the content of this box. It is a unique item. And um, I hope it will make a nice addition to my collection. And of course, I'm quite excited that I will ruin again the box, but Okay So this is the box. Yes, I managed to open it quite securely packaged We have wrapping paper as you can see and Here it is the item the item it is in this sack and whoa quite a large large box let me tell you it is with the aspect of uh, velvet it is in this uh, black or brown color and let me show you guys yes a wonderful pelican and i think that this uh, particular box is for a pelican m800 but look at the back it should uh, hold a nice little set what can i tell you it's made out of this velvet and we have here the mother with two cheeks the logo so uh, quite quite a nice looking uh, box and uh, guys i paid for this pelican box only 85 lays which means i paid 17.27 euros or approximately 20.657 american dollars and i have here this um, pelican m800 i think it is a nice addition and it looks quite quite nice let me see if it Oh, maybe it uh, wasn't meant for a um, large fountain like the Pelican M800 because it uh, barely closes. But I think it is a nice little box and I'm sure I will find a set suitable for uh, it. Quite, quite a nice looking box and uh, they don't appear on the market so often. Okay, guys, I will leave this aside. And now let's move on to this large, large package. I'm trying to see how I should open it. So, on one side it's the address and I don't want to show the address. So I will simply try to, to cut it on the side. Okay, so guys, let me show you what I... I am doing here so I managed to to just peel off the first layer it appears to be in a cardboard box inside okay let me see how I can cut it yes oh it is a box from a Huawei laptop I think yes quite nice Yes, it's some kind of laptop from Huawei. Laptop box. So this is the package. Okay. Okay, let me see. Maybe it will be better for you to see. Okay, the whole unpacking procedure. So this is quite nice look at it okay and here is the content and here it is the content guys so 
you see, I have this, the box is empty. Okay, and well wrapped in uh, to these bubbles. It is a quite, quite nice book. I must tell you that although I am a passionate collector and I try to find information, most of my informations are from the site, the Fountain Pen uh, Network. And in my library, I have only one book about fountain pens. I'm trying to deliver you information as accurate as I can. So this box, this book, written by Sergio Tavantini, La Pena Stilografica, Origini, Funzionamento e Collezione. The Fountain Pen, Origins, Working and Collection. As you can see, let me see. So I paid for this 160 lays. So it means I paid 32.50 euros or approximately 38.73 American dollars. I believe this is an edition written in Italian and uh, in English. I'm trying to see the year of the publishing, so all rights reserved. But I don't see a date. Let me see, maybe on, um, on the first page. I'm not so sure. This is the first time that I, uh, I see this uh, book. No, 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 no. So all rights reserved, you can see. All rights reserved, but no date. So I will simply look at it, guys. And it uh, seems, yes, we have on a date in September 1993. I will just uh, zoom uh, uh, of it. So lots of uh, colored photos. And lots of brands. Let me see on the table of content. Yes. So... We have a preface, introduction, chapter one with a brief history of fountain pen. From the origins to 1900, from the beginning of 20th century to the Second World War, from, from the post-war period to today. The parts are described, quite interesting. Let me see what brands of fountain pen we have in this book. So Aurora, Cartier, Chilton, Conklin, Dune, Montblanc, Omas, Parker Pen Company, Pelican, Sheffer, Tibaldi, Walt Eversharp Pen Company, AA Waterman, and EA -E -L -E Waterman Pen Company. So quite, quite, quite a nice book, guys. I think I didn't pay a large sum of money for it. So, along with this book, I also bought a fountain pen, and I will show it to you. Always this uh, nice lady, it, uh, uh, she packages them in um, those plastic uh, holders, and I think this is a very secure way to transport a fountain pen. You simply secured it at the end, and uh, here it is. I will push on this side in order for me to grab it from the other side, yes. And I'm quite impatient to see this beautiful, beautiful fountain pen. So it is my first fountain pen in this celluloid lapis Zui. As you can see, it is a small fountain pen. I believe it's from the 1920s or uh, late 1920s and early 1940s. Let me zoom on it, guys. So you can see here. Lady Duofold, Parker, Janesville, Lucky Curve, Fountain Pen USA, and a patent for 25-1. Of course, this lapis Zui has um, developed in time this black, black 
uh, patina to it but here we have uh, uh, on the cap the true color of this beauty we have you see here the three rings and let me show you the beautiful beautiful gold nib parky lucky curved pen let me see if we have a little bit of flex oh yes it is a quite flexy nib and judging by it it should be a bottom filler yes and it is a bottle filler and it appears to be functional so guys i paid for this fountain pen 420 lace which means i paid 85.32 euros or approximately 102 dollars to be exactly 101.67 american dollars this beautiful beautiful parker so guys those more were my unboxing for today in one box i had this case this quite large case of pelican i bought this wonderful book about fountain pens and also a nice nice looking fountain pen a parker fountain pen in this beautiful beautiful lapis zui thank you guys for your time if you've enjoyed this unboxing please subscribe to my channel to support my activity of course you will see all the items that i shown here in a detailed video where i will do the review of the fountain pen and maybe we will um, look through this book on a different subjects of course i don't want to make a mistake and present you all the work on my channel because this is uh protected copyright protected the book but maybe we will find out from its pages different filling mechanisms or uh, other uh, great stuff by the way guys you can leave in the comments if you want for me to do a special video on the history of the fountain pens or about a certain element of fountain pens i will sure be glad to oblige and make a special video for you till then guys i want to wish you to have a nice day wherever you are bye bye and please take care of yourselves